Bonjour, hello and welcome to today's snow report. We have had a cold and chilly start to the week, but with clear skies out here in Les Trois Vallées, and it has been glorious. There was a significant increase in traffic up the mountain on Saturday, which can now be seen on the piste, with lots more skiers in resort, and the start of uh, lift queues, which is something we have not seen for the past few weeks. It looks like we are also now getting a break of snow, with the forecast showing a run of clear days ahead, no bluebirds, but sun with cloud cover and temperature are around minus 5 up to minus 10. Right, where to ski when it's busy? Well, I'm a fan of the fourth valley of the three valleys, Orel, and this season they have created a new piece too, Croix d'Antide, a blue running from the Perron lift. This new piece is in addition to previous Perron run and it's well worth checking out. If you are staying in Valterrance, then it is a good idea to head straight over from uh, some quiet slopes in the morning before the rest of the Sri Valley skiers arrive. While it's a small ski area in itself, the slopes are long and snow conditions tend to be great over in this valley. There are a couple of access routes from Valterrance for gentle skiers. You may want to opt for taking the Grand Fond lift and then an easy run down on either the blue Gentiane or Red Morionnaise. If you want something a bit more challenging, then head up Simcaron to the summit and take the black Combe de Rosaël into the Orel Valley. It is a sharp left once you descend from the telecabine and quite easy to miss, so keep an eye out. Also, this run, not surprisingly, tends to be pretty quiet and most time you will have the slope to yourself. Then, after a morning ski, if you want an alternative route back to Valterans, then you can try the awesome zip wire flying over the mountains from 3,230 meters. It costs 50 euros for each trip and you don't need to book in advance, so just turn up on the day. If there are a lot of people, you will just have to wait your turn. Of thought, it shouldn't be a long wait as each flight takes just 1 minute 45 seconds. Access is via the lift Perron and Boucher and it is right at the top. You cannot miss it. Your skis or snowboard will be strapped to the wire too and you will fly over the slope back to Valterans, arriving at the top of the Valterans lift from where you can ski the rest of your day with highest zip wire in Europe ticket of the bucket list. In terms of start, the snow level have not really altered uh, since our last report with a measurement of 285 cm at 3200 meters and 240 cm at 2300 meters. This level does not look set to change with no uh, fresh snow forecast and this low temperature we are having at the moment should preserve condition pretty nicely. Well, we have the Winter Olympics starting this week, which uh, I, uh, for one, uh, I'm pretty excited about. I love it. I'm sure you will be cheering for Team Grand Bretagne, but uh, we have some local French skiers from the Belleville Valley competing uh, in ski, snowboard, ski resort and slope style. So keep a look out for the talent from uh, the Sri Valley on your screens. The names to keep an eye on are Adrien Théo, Jean-Frédéric Chapuis, Chloé Trépoche and Lou Barra. Bonne chance à tous, good luck. Right, have a great week all, à bientôt, see you next time, Aurélien Claire for valtonet.com. <laughs>